Avengers Infinity War new trailer, Iron Man attacks Star-Lord is this why? Avengers Infinity War's latest TV spot sees Robert Downey Jr.'s Iron Man attacking Chris Pratt's Star-Lord, but why? With two weeks to go until the release of the Marvel epic, the marketing campaign is heating up with more and more TV spots. The latest, called Legacy, looks back at the last ten years of the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but it also shows a couple of split-second scenes. Around the 24-second mark is one shot that lasts less than a second, and boy is it intriguing. Iron Man is attacking Star-Lord and the Guardian of the Galaxy is not happy about this at all. So what could be causing the beef between Tony Stark and Peter Quill? Well a recent full trailer for Avengers Infinity War saw the two superheroes, both known for their arrogance, clashing in conversation so perhaps it's something to do with that. In a scene which appears to be on Thanos' home planet of Titan, Star-Lord decides to challenge Iron Man's plan in front of Spider-Man and the Guardians of the Galaxy. Star-Lord says, let's talk about this plan of yours. Quill continues, I think it's good, except it sucks. So let me do the plan, that way it might be really good. Looking blankly and disgruntled into the distance, Stark simply replies, Wow. Earlier this week Avengers Infinity War directors Joe and Anthony Russo revealed there's a close link between Iron Man and Thanos. Joe Russo said, I think he, Thanos, has the most specific connection to Tony because Tony is a futurist, and he has predicted a threat like Thanos. It's lived in his brain even though he couldn't name it. Russo added, Tony is the most desperately driven, down to the core, to react against something like Thanos, although all the heroes will face a threat, no matter who it is or where it comes from. But I think this is intrinsic to Tony's psychology. Because Tony started it all with Iron Man, he has a special connection to the threat that's facing him. Avengers Infinity War will be released in UK cinemas on April 26, 2018.